How many people here want to make films but aren't making films? Hmm. Right, well, there's no excuse, just by the by. There's absolutely no excuse. This is what you require. You have an idea, right? You get a piece of paper and you look at it with a pencil and you think about the idea and you, you do some research. Like, it's good to research. It's good because, A, it's exciting and enriching and, 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 and you learn something in your life. And you write that all down on one hand. And then you say, okay, I want to make a point. You know, like, what that story is? I want to express something or give someone some kind of feeling. Even if it's just I want to make people laugh or I want to make people cry or I want to make them laugh and cry and I want to do something about the stolen generation. So you put those three things together, and then you look at story examples. I mean, this is just my process. It could be bunkum, but this is how I go about it. So you look at story examples. Now, that's interesting because almost all stories are track... You can track them through, through history as having primary shades. You know, Romeo and Juliet was not written by William Shakespeare. You know, it was taken from a John Brown poem, which goes back to a Greek myth called Pyramus and Thisbe. And if you go into sort of... Um, you know, um, Indian storytelling, you'll find essential story shapes. You know, two young people, they fall in love by happenstance. The incumbent adult world doesn't want them to be together and ends in tragedy, right? And you can see examples of that all the way through. So you pick your sort of story shape that you like, you get the piece of paper and you sit down and you write it. You write it down. And you don't stop writing until you've got a beginning, a middle and end. Let me tell you, that is the absolute hardest part of the process. And anyone who gets through that the rest of it is, relatively speaking, I wouldn't say it was fun, <laughs> but there's just no comparison to the terror and the difficulty and the pain in staring at a piece of white paper with a pencil in your hand. And let's think about it, given that some people, not me, right, get paid multi, multi, multi millions of dollars if they do it really, really well, and it only takes a pencil and a piece of paper, it must be hard. <laughs> Otherwise, everybody would do it, <laughs> right? So that is step one, write it down. Write down a page, two pages, shape it out, you know, and what? Your screenplay can be one page. Then go and get a video camera or borrow it. Bring all your friends together. Use your energy, energy to convince them that, you know, it's a great thing to be involved in your storytelling or story making. Roll camera, edit in camera if you haven't got a computer, and make a movie. Now, I say that kind of energetically because... Someone told me that when I was very young. Mm. 